Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for October the 23rd of 2019. Well, it is titled Starry Night by Vincent van Gogh. So what do we see here? Well, exactly what it states in the title. This is the famous painting by Vincent van Gogh titled Starry Night. And you look out and see the scenery in the foreground and then up in the sky a number of stars and a lot of swirling patterns too which are quite interesting and you can wonder what this means and of course as a piece of art it is open to some interpretation as to exactly what is meant there if it's meant just to show uh, the patterns in the night sky that you might see could it represent something like a comet which would have been easily visible at this time or even uh, images although would never look this large of spiral galaxies now at the time he painted this we didn't know what a galaxy was particularly but we did know of spiral nebulae and they looked a lot like some of the sketches that he makes here so it's interesting to wonder what that might have meant in terms of you know what it meant to him in terms of looking at the sky we also see a number of stars. They don't form any recognizable pattern associated with other stars in the sky. And in fact, there seem to be a large number of bright stars could represent planets, obviously a very bright planet close to the horizon. It could often represent Venus, uh, but that's not necessarily the case here. They could represent other planets or could represent stars but not any pattern or, or that we can see that ties in with anything that we know of in the sky. The one recognizable pattern for sure in the sky is the moon way off to the uh, right hand side. Now the moon here is depicted as a crescent, although there has been some artistic uh, license taken with it in order to show the moon as a crescent like this. The crescent is far, wraps far more around the moon than a crescent moon ever can. So while we can see crescent moons, they will never look quite like this, almost taking a whole bite out of the moon and looking like there's just a little chunk taken out of one side of the moon. The crescent, uh, the limbs of the crescent will never go that far around. They'd be back towards the top of the moon, top of the moon, covering about half the moon. Still, even at the various uh, crescent phases, and certainly at a crescent phase like this, would not wrap all the way around to the point where they're almost touching. So, Certainly a little bit of artistic license taken there with the moon, but still a nice image of the moon there. And of course, the entire well known uh, image that we see with the moon, the stars, the swirling patterns, and even a glow along the horizon uh, that we see, as well as the city here in the foreground, making up the famous painting Starry Night by Vincent van Gogh. So that was our picture of the day for October the 23rd of 2019. It was titled Starry Night by Vincent van Gogh. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture previewed to be Seahorse Sky. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.